Good morning, GHS. I'm Maestro Yaga. I'm Abrio Uriosta. And welcome to The Morning Show. Today we begin with an announcement about the upcoming fall concert on October 10th in the Performing Arts Center. The concert will feature the GHS Marching Band, Jazz Band and Choir, and the cost in, of admission is only $3. Visit the Grants High School website for the QR code to purchase tickets. Also, stay tuned to the morning show as we will have an interview with members of the band and choir. Also on Tuesday, October 10th, the New Mexico College Access Council is presenting a college fair at NMSU grants from 9 to 11 a.m. There will be more than 20 institutions present that day, so this will be a great opportunity, not just for seniors, but for any student that wants to shop for college. Okay. So, you've all heard of an emotional support animal. Have you ever heard of an emotional support alligator? No, I have not. <laughs> I haven't either. On September 29th, a man from Philadelphia went to go to the Phillies game with his emotional support alligator, Wally. They entered, but they were denied as they entered. But the owner says that he was invited by the Phillies fans, by their, by their teammates, and yet they were denied entry. So huh. I don't know what happened there. That's Mis weird. Some miscommunication or something. Yeah, I've but, never heard of that before. Yeah, That's so cool. That. On October 1st, 2023, a woman named Dorothy Hoffman went skydiving in an attempt to set the record for world's oldest skydiver at the age of 104. She states, age is just a number. After a full seven minutes, they finally landed safely on the ground and Hoffman said, wonderful. It was so wonderful up there. The whole thing was delightful. Wonderful. Couldn't have been better. I got a question. Would you rather go skydiving or bungee jumping? I think I would rather go skydiving because bungee jumping scares me. It does. It seems like one minute the rope can just snap on you, but it like can skydiving, snap, yeah. I feel like you like know that you're falling, so like you're already prepared yeah. to fall. Yeah, and you have a parachute, so yeah, you're covered. Yeah, you're covered. <laughs> now let's go to the sports calendar for today. The GHS volleyball teams will hit the road to Aztec to take on the Lady Tigers. The Lady Pirates have only two non-district games remaining, including today's game before district's action next week. Hello, I'm Aubriana Garcia, and I'm here with... Isom Sariaga. And today I'm going to be interviewing her about some volleyball. So, um, you recently played Cottonwood. How was the game? Uh, I think the game went really well. We did. We were hustling a lot, which was pretty intense. At the end, we kind of got comfortable with our lead because it was 2-0 and I think we just weren't focused and the crowd was really intense and so it was kind of messing with their heads a little bit I thought. Yeah. Um, when is district's game? Um, I'm not sure I think it's in two weeks from today we play against Valencia so it's coming up pretty quick. Okay um, and what position do you play in volleyball? Um, I play a middle hitter. Okay. And how well as a team do you guys play together? Uh, I think we play really well, you know. We've known each other for like a couple of years. We all played together two years ago. We were all on JV and so this year just coming up it was really nice. We all really flow well together and so it's a really good team. Okay. And coming up as Aztec is coming up tomorrow. Um, is it a home or away game? Uh, it'll be away. Away. And how do you think we're going to be playing tomorrow? Uh, I think we're going to do really good. Hopefully we beat them because we beat them two years ago we went, when we went over there, and so it would be really nice to beat them again. Okay, thank you. The GHS soccer teams are also in action today, but at home, as they host Highland in a pair of district contests. The girls get things going at 4 p.m., and the boys will follow. Time is running out to catch these teams at home, so go out and support. Well, that's all we have for today. Tomorrow, please tune in for another all-sports show. Same time, same place. Thank you for, Thank watching. for watching. And remember, we, we are, are GHS, GHS for success. success.